再びピッコロ様の天下がよみがえるのだ Alright, guys, what is going on? My name is Germ, and welcome back to the channel. And if you guys are new here, as always, leave your boy a like and a subscribe, man. Today, it's gonna be a doozy of a video. Let's just say that much. Today, we're going to be running Piccolo Jr., it, Piccolo Jr. here against the hardest event in the game, 8th Anniversary Sin Shenron. So, the reason I'm gonna say this is gonna be a doozy of an event is because this team, Piccolo Jr., is insanely, insanely good. I think Piccolo Jr. is the best TUR by far. It's just that he is not a good leader. <laughs> this guy's team is essentially a bunch of big bad bosses characters and orange piccolo, right? But you want to run this guy with characters that have thirst for conquest, big bad bosses. It... But if there's not like a lot of options on the team, there are. It's just that those options on teams that are 170% are kind of bad. I am, of course, talking about the coolers. Now, the coolers are very good, right? STR Final Form Cooler is very good. Uh, LR Metal Cooler, he's like, okay. You know, STR EZA Cooler, he's good. It's just, without a 200% leader skill to really run them on, they are not cooking up as much as they usually are, right? So it kind of just leaves Piccolo Jr. to take care of all of the damage, all of the skill, everything. So it's just, it's kind of tough, right? The coolers can sort of get caught on a setup like this. I think Piccolo Jr. should perform A-OK. -okay. I think he'll be fine. Like, look at how much damage we're already doing. That's just Piccolo Jr. himself. <laughs> so, yeah, we'll, we'll have to be just... We'll kind of just have to play around, be a little careful with how we're putting our units and stuff like that. But I think we should, overall, just have a pretty decent experience, right? I don't think we're going to be, like, dying super easily. Maybe in the final phase. Or look at that, turn three, and we're already facing off against the uh, AGL Sin. So... Yeah, uh, that should go to show you how strong Piccolo Jr. actually is. Like I said, I do think that Piccolo Jr. is the best non-easy ATUR in the game. So, having stuff like that, not bad. Not bad. I decided to go ahead and bring Turles as well. Turles is also one of the strongest TURs in the game. Once you actually, If you get his links up and stuff like that. Turles is very good, right? He's one of the best characters on the Piccolo Jr. team. I also brought Amon and Raisin, who I do think are the best banner unit in the game, right? But a million times better than that fraud they uh, decided to bring out uh baby so <laughs> not bad not bad all right and then explaining the rest of the team my orange piccolo is to do orange piccolo shenanigans then we have golden frieza because basically have to run golden frieza and then obviously piccolo jr for the leader skill and str eza cooler because he's at least giving somewhat of a semblance of support to piccolo jr actually no he's not no he's not because this guy is terrifying conquerors unless you're fighting two or more enemies so or sorry he's transformation boost which i think is isn't piccolo on let me see he should be no he's not okay cool that's fine though that's fine i think str eza cooler should perform okay we'll see how he does without his um he's already double digit thinking that that's not bad we'll see how he does without his uh frieza clan links uh <laughs> it's a little scary what you're doing there sin it's a it's a little, uh, little, little, little terrifying what you are. Uh, yeah, I figured it out. I knew it. I knew it, you goddamn. God damn it. <laughs> I knew it, damn it. I knew he was going to do that, man. All right. Let's make a cut. We'll make it right back. All right. So we're back. We're back. Uh, pretty similar situation to where we were at before, right? I decided to switch up the team a little bit. And instead of STR Cooler, I'll bring this AGL. Sorry. This STR Piccolo from the Metal Cooler movie. It's just, yeah, it, it's just a lot of wonkiness. Piccolo Jr. doesn't really work well with a lot of the units on his team, right? He does work well with the Terrifying Conquerors, but his 200% leader skill doesn't really give that option to those Terrifying Conquer units, right? Because his 200% is for World Tournament, which is himself. Oh, huh, okay. How much are we going to take from this? How much should we take? <laughs> 700k, huh, pal? Uh, tell you what, tell you what. We'll, uh, we'll go to a different team. I don't think Piccolo Jr. himself can actually take care of this team. Can take care of this one. He could. He probably can. It's just uh, tough. Tough to do. Tough to do. Yeah. We'll, we'll go with that. We'll, we'll go with that. We'll go with that. Okay. So I decided to swap over to the 23rd World Tournament Goku team instead. I just think it's going to be a better time for all of us. Uh, Piccolo Jr. on this team, by the way, is actually crazy. Because when you can get his World Tournament links active, 
it, it, his Dragon Ball Saga links active his world tournament. Oh, my phone's dying. Sweet. Oh, okay, yeah, there's LR Metal Cooler being the fraud that he uh, usually tends to be. Here's the thing. LR Metal Cooler is one of Piccolo Jr.'s best linking partners, and the boy can get frauded out pretty easily, right? LR Metal Cooler is probably the worst carnival LR. It's just... <laughs> ah, man. It sucks, man. P Piccolo Jr. is just like a really weird character. But, I mean, look at, look at the attacks that he just put up, though. <laughs> I mean, hey... Ain't that many characters putting up an 11 million attacks that followed by 13 million. <laughs> Super fast against all types, man. He's insane. The damage that Piccolo Jr. can do is absolutely crazy. It's just getting there. And then you Krillin. <laughs> Krillin, one of the best banner units in the game as well. I would personally put this guy in second place right behind Amond and Raisin. Of course, a full dodge build will help you there, of course. Okay, Krillin, show us the magic. Ow. <laughs> okay, thanks for the... Oh, the audio wasn't even on for the full dodge, Krillin. I uh, appreciate that, buddy. <laughs> I don't know why I gave it to you if you're not going to do it. I am a dodge defender, though. I am a dodge defender. All right, we'll be back. We'll, 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 get, to, we'll get to physical sin. Don't worry. All right, so we're back. And with a, <laughs> ho hopefully, a good rotation. You know, uh, Piccolo Jr. really hasn't been performing up to standards. Let's just say that much. But it's okay. It's, it's not Piccolo Jr.'s fault. It's just the units around them. You know, it's, it's just, yeah. Piccolo Jr. is very good. It's just uh, the team around him. I mean, I'm running a pretty decent team as well, man. It's just we were we were unlucky with where Sin placed a super attack, right? Curling it in practice will dodge. It's fine. It's fine. So let's see. Let's see. How will Krillin perform? I mean, Piccolo Jr. has been doing absolutely insane this entire run. It's just... I, I'm just getting unlucky. That was, that's, that's about it, man. Now, I know Piccolo Jr. can do it because <laughs> every other top TUR in the game can do it. So, okay. How much does he take from this? one super okay that's not bad that that is that is not bad at all holy hell i got scared for a second man I, i'm not gonna lie to you guys i, I got a little scared there. krillin doing his thing <laughs> this str krillin is actually just insanity too by the way, man. It, it's actually like really fun all right cool do we live uh, this turn we should be able to why because we're gonna pop kid goku's active skill get the attack we're just gonna go ahead chill out here real quickly real quickly right let's get all these orbs let's get the damage destruction with kid goku right here right right and then we'll get the Bulma support yes we can boom easy an easy turn and then next turn we can hopefully revive with lr metal cooler that way this guy right here becomes full power tech world tournament goku we have metal cooler on the rotation with piccolo jr to get most of the links active it's gonna be great Great, but it's, 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 it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. Trust, trust me. <laughs> trust, trust me when I say it's gonna be. It's gonna be fun. I hope. I hope that's how it's played. That's how it plays out. Because you know, I might want to see what Piccolo Jr. can do against Eighth Anniversary Sin Shenron. Right? You know, just, just a tad, just a tiny bit. I want to see what Piccolo Jr. can do against Eighth Anniversary Sin. Uh, let's see. So we are gonna kill AGL Sin this turn. Perfect. So here we go. We do have a fan anniversary since Shenron finally out and ready to play. Oh, oh, okay. Giant Piccolo Jr. Oh, guess what? I forgot about this. This is in his back pocket. Piccolo Jr. is essentially Orange Piccolo. So, uh, fellas, enjoy the train. You know, go grab yourself a snack. Go grab yourself a drink. A quick little drinky drinky. Oop, oopsie, oopsie. Disconnected the cord. Go grab yourself a little snack, a little drink. Uh, Piccolo Jr. is just going to kind of chill out. But we know when we come back, uh, we ain't going to be taking any super attacks over here. <laughs> the second we come back from Piccolo Jr. being done with giant mode is we're safe, essentially. So let me make a quick cut. We'll cut out the uh, foreverness of Piccolo Jr. And then we'll be right back as soon as Piccolo Jr. is done. All right, so boom, and we can pop Piccolo Jr.'s active as well. So, yeah, let's go ahead and do it, boys. Let's go ahead and just get even more damage in. In a little bit, I guess. Let me make a cut.
very good by piccolo jr now we are at 800k defense let's go ahead now let's see what happens it goes down to eight almost 900k i think we're gonna be fine just doing this though we do know that uh unfortunately mr sin shenron over here will not be doing a super attack or aoe's so let's just see what piccolo jr is gonna be able to cook up for us yeah double digit tanking that, that's it that, that is all piccolo that that's it nice nice dude type disadvantage double digit tanking the hardest boss in the game while hitting about 16 million attacks that's super bad against all types yeah piccolo jr is insane piccolo jr is actually just uh crazy <laughs> now if only he got additionals for me that would be pretty cool too but you know what let's take our wins how we can get them right however we can do them. so yeah not bad by piccolo jr at all i, I am impressed with this performance this video is there anything I really want to say negatively about him? His team sucks. That, that's pretty much it. His leader skill sucks, but the unit himself, 10 out of 10. T 10 out of 10 unit, right? Best world tournament unit and the best TUR in Dokkan, I mean. Make it fair and easy, right? Okay, cool. We're taking damage. Thanks. <laughs> Thank you, 23rd World Tournament Goku. I, I really appreciate you doing that for me. Let's see if we can get one more turn with Piccolo Jr. And if not, well, we'll just wrap up. But yeah, ah, uh, well, that's unfortunate. Yeah, Piccolo Jr., very good. Sol solid character, for sure. And that, there's the Dodgers, Krillin. Thank you. Thank you, Krill Dog. Appreciate you for that. Kamehameha. Can we actually do this? I feel like we have a, I, I feel like we have a shot of doing it, for sure. Let's see. All right, I'm putting on my gamer, uh, I'm putting on my gamer socks, man. Let's see if we can do this, man. My gaming skills. Okay, that's good. Listen, it was by my gaming power that I placed the super attack on Krillin for a reason. <laughs> very good. Very good by Krillin. All right. I have a feeling we can actually do this. If, if Goku's guarding, we might be able to actually live. Let's see. He is not. But he's taking double the damage. Uh, Kid Go... Is it only one AoE? Oh, unless Kid Goku does that. <laughs> Hold on. If it's only one AOE we're going to take, that's fine by me. Oh, never mind. I thought he was going to take less than that. Well, there you guys go, though. That was Piccolo Jr. against the hardest boss in the game. He did spectacularly. He did amazing. If you guys made it to the end of the video, as always, leave your boy a like, a subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.